What's up everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Crystal. If you are new here, if you are a returning subscriber, hi, how are ya? So today I'm going to be doing take care of my teeth, what I do in between my teeth cleanings, things like that. If you want to see how I keep my teeth clean and healthy, then keep on watching. <laughs> So the first thing that I'm going to do is take out my rubber bands. Okay, and then I pop my tears out. First thing that I always like to do is floss. And I know that flossing is supposed to come after you brush your teeth, but I like to floss. Just watch, I'm telling you, it makes sense. So I'll just wash my teeth. They're kind of sensitive right now because I'm sorry, my cat went to my bathroom because I just got new trays and as you can, I don't know if you can see these bumps on my teeth. Um, I had to get attachments on my front teeth, so. Once I'm done flossing, I start brushing. So I use the 3D White Oral-B automatic toothbrush. Now, I am going to say this, whenever you get new trays, this bristle is rough on my teeth, so this can hurt my teeth, and it actually hurts my teeth right now, so you'll see me stop, you'll see what I do. So right now, I'm just using uh, Colgate. I literally put like a dime size amount on like that. Let me brush away. your tongue because that is where all the germs lay and that is where bad breath comes from. As you can see, I did not go in the front of my teeth. Like I said, this bristle is very hard. So if I go in front of my teeth like that, all this tooth here and all of these, it, it's too, it hurts too bad. It feels like I'm going to electric it. Once I'm done getting my back teeth with the automatic, and this is really good. I have my wisdom teeth in and I'm keeping my wisdom teeth because I have enough room for them. But this can get way back there and since it spins I feel like it really gets my back wisdom teeth clean. Now for the front of my teeth, I basically do the same exact process over. I put a little less on this time because I don't need that much. And then I don't turn the thingy on and I just brush the front. For the fun part. Time to water floss my teeth. So if you do not have one of these, I would get one. I got this one for 30 bucks on Amazon. I love this thing. Basically like a flosser, but it just shoots out water. It really gets things out of your teeth that you've missed or the floss couldn't get or you didn't get it when you brush. So what I do is I fill it up. My teeth are very sensitive to cold water, so I'm gonna fill mine up with lukewarm water. This thing has three different modes, normal, soft, and pulse. I cannot use normal, normal is so strong, it hurts my teeth. I'm gonna use normal just to show you oh, how intense it is. So all you do is you just hit the on button. But watch this. So as you can see that, it moved my tray with my Invisalign in it. So as you can imagine, normal is pretty hard. I cannot use it. Maybe people that don't have Invisalign can use it. I don't even think I could use it if I didn't have Invisalign, just because my teeth are so sensitive. The soft mode, I can use the soft mode. All you do, you put it in your mouth and you just turn it on and you just go through your teeth. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'll do it like three to four times just to make sure I got everything. So just did the same exact thing on the bottom. That's basically it. As you can see, this thing was filled up. So I used um, a little bit more than half on my teeth, but this thing is really good. Again, like I said, I have my wisdom teeth in so I can really get back there and get all the gunk out that is stuck in my wisdom teeth. Last but not least, I mouthwash. Invisalign trays, I'm not gonna put them in just yet. So a lot of people 
I've been wanting to see the inside of my teeth, my mouth. I'm not really sure why, but um, I figured I would show you guys. So I'm gonna try my best to I'm gonna get up here first. I don't think that's gonna work, so let me pull yins down. So now let me just talk to you about where I'm at with Invisalign. Just like a little update. It has been quite a while since my last update. So I went back to my dentist last week because I had to get rescanned. Um, as you can see, that front tooth is still pretty crooked. Well, I had to get rescanned to get new trays, and I thought it was just gonna be like a few trays, maybe like five or six. Tell me why I got 23 new trays again. So I started with 23 and they gave me 23 more. So that sucks. I got 23 more trays to do that and I have to change them every 10 days. So that's like another 210 days of Invisalign, which sucks. Another thing is I got new attachments put in my mouth. As you can see, I got two on there and in there on one tooth. I got two attachments on one tooth, which is kind of weird. And then I have the same two here. This on, this on, that on, that on, and that on, and that on, and then my hooks. So another weird thing that happened was the dentist said that Invisalign thought that my overbite was fixed, so he they sent me the trays without the the hooks. Let me show you the hooks that my original Invisalign came with, so my bands can get attached. As you can see, right there, these hooks were pre-made from Invisalign. So Invisalign thought that I didn't need to wear my elastics anymore, so they sent me trays without them. And I was freaking out because I don't think my overbite's fixed at all. Thankfully, my dentist agreed that he does not think my overbite is fixed either. So what he did is just took the trays and he cut them himself. I don't know, you can't really see, but he cut the trays and he cut this one too. A little indent there. He cut both of them. This is the little chewy thing that I just wanted. Thankfully, he agreed with me about that I still need to wear my elastics. So I still wear my elastics, except something has changed. Now, I wear four. So not much has changed since the last time uh, that Ian saw me. He said I got 23 new trays, which kind of sucks. I will tell you this though. Whenever I put my first new tray on last week, it hurts so bad. I didn't eat four. I want to say, I think I ate once that day because it hurts so bad. I mean, I guess that means that it's working. The main ones that hurt were these ones right here, especially the one with the attachments. That's basically all I have right now. This is where I'm at. This is what my teeth look like right now. Guys, let me know. What do you think of my teeth so far? Can you tell a difference? Does my overbite seem better? So far, I am super happy with the results. I'm excited to see the end result. That's all I have for you right now. I hope you enjoyed watching this little video, and I will talk to you guys soon.